So now we just wait like two minutes for the server to start, and then we it can doesn't... join it. What? Did it take two minutes less? Hmm. What? Does it take two minutes? I think it does because it wasn't responding for me until like a, a few minutes after I started it. Team CMD takes thirty seconds. So, did you figure out how to port forward? I hate to admit I don't know what that means. Like you, you didn't once try to make your own Minecraft server. No. That's and crazy. Surprisingly, I don't feel bad about it. That's crazy. Wasn't our There's first no... interaction in person me helping you install a Minecraft mod? Actually, now that I think about it, I might have done it at some point, but just not realized it. Oh no, if it involves me getting up to go look at something, I'll probably have remembered it. It pretty sure it does. Um, cause I had to, I mean, at least for my router and internet provider, I had to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for me, like it, it says not responding and then after like a minute, it like opens my game and then puts me in. So like, I think it's because it's starting, but I'm not sure. Because the logs, like, make it seem like it's already started, but, like, it says server has successfully started. No, 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 no. The mod I asked you for help with when I was 11 was a Halo 2 energy sword mod. <laughs> no way. No way, dude. Was it? I don't remember what mod it was, but I, I just remember I helped you install a Minecraft mod. For some reason, my memory is just, like, incredibly good today. Yeah, it must have been back when there wasn't a forge installer and you'd have to like open your Minecraft jar and drag in all of the forge stuff like mm -hmm. manually. The percent app data. Yeah. Percent app data. That changed my life. Okay, I'm joining. No, but I mean, it, it could have also been after and you were just not smart enough to know how to use the forge installer and then every i mean it was I, yeah, I don't know like every single game that has forge mod support i've never used forge so forge is only a, a minecraft thing yeah but i'm pretty sure you have to install overwolf which uh is definitely a virus no idea what you're talking what's up wolfie doing work I think I've, I've I've really streamlined the joining the server process. I've figured it out. I dude, I can't believe this thirteen dollar Arc server host is worse than my like two dollar and fifty cent Minecraft server host. I guess because Minecraft's easier to to run a server for. Okay. Everything's looking good so far. Let's I found out someone. Okay, I'm loading in. Dude, I think like I'll be happy. Like peak happiness is is when I have a computer where I can stream, run an arc at max settings, and like get 200 FPS. That would be crazy. Not gonna happen. I will no, in the I'm future, dude. When 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 when, my, when we look back at arc, like we look back at Doom now. Yeah. It's gonna be possible. Well, yeah, but you're like emotions. On how you perceive it aren't gonna be oh insane. i think they will dude on my rtx like freaking 90 70 dude no unless you can run 200 fps at like movement speed 300 percent while you're like flying through the world I, well i mean enough what? years in the future that will be possible yeah but but then you'll have like like five viewers <laughs> i'm Things will be different. He'll be a different person. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, I think I'm in. Like, life has a different nope. tint to it when you get to six viewers. It really does, man. You didn't turn on map. Uh, I couldn't there. find the setting for it. It must be in the... Uh, let me see if it's in the, the text okay. thing. I buy, like, the generic spawn. That we were um, at last time. Okay. Spawning in. Wait, what did you turn hun hunger drain to? I think I left it at default. 
Okay, that's probably fine. If if anything's like really off, then we can just change it. Oh, your server has damage text. Does it? Yeah, it does. This is doing twelve damage. That's correct. Oh yeah, I see. Wait, I see your damage text. I think. Are you still doing damage, or was it a bug? Yeah, yeah. No, it has like screw. Oh, there, there you are. All right, let's get the drive. <laughs> Dude, your character. It looks like you're wearing a mask. Yeah, the log strider. That's insane. Dude, how did you do oh, that? Like wait, wait. Walk into the light. Walk, walk into the light here. Dude, you see what's like lefted? <laughs> Dude, how did you do this? <laughs> oh my. My. This is what happens when you eat the Ryan on the orange. Oh yeah, the K thing works now. Okay. Yeah, so there should yeah, there's there's no tether now. We can we dude, I you could be here and I could be in the north and it would be fine. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, yeah. Hold on, I gotta I gotta close my my chrome so I get better frame rate. How did you die? Uh because my character needs to eat like fifty thousand calories a day. Oh, John. hello, love aside. How are you? Playing, playing Ark right now. It's a dinosaur game. There's dinosaurs. It's kind of like Rust, but with dinosaurs. I'm, I'm pretty good. Thanks for asking. Very excited for, for some Ark. Wait, who's that? Is that your dead body? Okay. Yeah. Glad to hear. Took yes. Like Thirty seconds to find it. That's gonna be a problem. Yeah, I don't know why you wanted to turn off the. It my just game, sounded like my a game. Good idea. Roblox Chipotle grind didn't last very long. Well, it sort of was like a, a one time event. Um, didn't you do it for I like nine hours? Uh, my longest run was six hours. Like, continuous run. Like, six hours straight. Not long enough. But is it, the event's over now. I don't. Can you still even play the game? Like, I think it, I'd it'd be a little uh, psychopathic if I were to continue doing that with you know nothing, nothing, nothing at stake. Got the burrito code, then never played it again. Yeah, I didn't even get that. I I didn't find out about it until towards the end. Um, which if I knew about it earlier, I could have done more, more runs. Yeah, I mean the game's still up, but it's like there's not really any point to. To playing it. Where does that game exist? What? Besides for the code. It, just for Chipotle to advertise. I knew about the game, but not the event. Yeah. <laughs> they make an obby. Pretty wacky. Dude, a, a Chipotle obby would have been way better. They should have done an obby with like a million stages, and if you beat the obby, you get the burritos for yeah, year. Why is a nine year old going to want to make burritos? Yeah, right? It's like such a stupid, mindless task. Like, why would you want to do that? Yeah, you're gonna get... Well, it's basically like job training in Roblox. Yeah, exactly. I mean, they're, they're trying to brainwash kids to come work at Chipotle. Wait, okay. Okay. Settings feel pretty pretty alright so far. Yeah, this might be the, be the best character you've made so far, dude. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> oh. It actually looks like a mask. Like your your head <laughs> looks like a mask. Dude, you're not commenting <laughs> on my leg portions. You I I haven't even looked down at your legs to be honest. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> pretty beefy. Okay. Dude, if you installed naturalism v2, I could customize the <laughs> Yeah. Um sadly there's no slider. You, I'm surprised we haven't tried playing like a Roblox Ark clone before. It, I, I don't know if it exists, but it pretty likely does. I feel like we have. There's like a, a Roblox Ark, or there's like a Roblox clone for virtually every game. So. Pretty likely we've done something like that. Need more clientele after the whole Sam Nell situation? I didn't hear about that actually. I'm not really a big, a big Chipotle fan, so. I've had Chipotle like once ever. And uh, it was okay. That's why they're targeting children. Yeah, they, I, I guess they gotta recover. You know, gotta gotta make that money back. Get get more employees. 
These are, yeah, dude, kids have no idea what salmonella is. When I didn't know, dude, I, I used to just like, you know, I'd handle, I'd eat raw eggs when I was a kid, just swallow I them. I didn't really understand salmonella, but now I do. Dude, when I was 12, trying to gain weight, I'd put like, like half a gallon of milk in the blender and like a raw <laughs> egg. I did it once actually. Nice, dude. So I like it's like an Arnold documentary. He did that. I just made protein shakes. Don't like Chipotle. They're not really that great. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of like burritos or, or whatever. So I've never really felt too inclined to like go eat there. So I haven't. Um, milk and egg. That sounds vile. It's the only. It's the only way to put on weight. Milk, yeah. milk and eggs. Did we start in the in the yeah we started in the nice area, Joe? Do you want to build here again? What's like the easiest dino to tame? That probably we uh, any of the like a dodo is probably the easiest. No no no, no like that that actually is, probably is good. Dilophosaur or I mean, pterodons are pretty easy, but you just gotta wait for them to land and then throw a bowl at them. <laughs> Characters ripped, oh, right? Good. Look at his neck; it's so big. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> like, your character doesn't even look like an art character. It's so weird. <laughs> yeah, it's because I made the proportions so weird on the arms. If the upper body <laughs> wasn't, like, how the did you fill of the tumors? <laughs> Never skip point. neck day. Yeah, not once. Not once. Just like me. Joe, are you still super big into neck exercise? Or are you, like, done with that phase? with that like a year and a half ago oh it was bad like the neck curls not a good idea one of my physical therapists had me doing some neck exercises for a few weeks well yeah because physical therapists are weird <laughs> exactly yeah they, they don't know what they're talking about dude <laughs> they don't know the first thing about working out okay well i've heard bad things First physical therapy, then acupuncture, then, then like, then you're getting raped. <laughs> I think acupuncture might be the worst. I think you, I want to flip the order. Are like, acupuncture and like chiropractors like is that just all like pseudoscience? I don't know, but I know they're related. Because whenever I tell anyone like I went to a chiropractor, they're like, oh yeah, how'd that go? <laughs> like I don't know. There's a little bit of a stigma against them. Yeah. I don't know if it's true or not. Yeah, acupuncture? I, I don't know. I, uh... Oh, there's a guy coming up behind you. I had dry needling done on my chest. I don't know if... I think it's kind of similar to acupuncture. Dry needle? Is that like... They, like, put a needle through your muscle to, like, make it less stiff. That sounds awful. I just... Yeah, I mean, it was okay. I'm gonna cry needling. Never met anyone? I don't think I have either. <clears throat> yeah, dude, I think South Zone 1 is just the spot. Mm -hmm. I think the dry needling helped me. It, like, feels pretty weird. Because they're just putting, like, a needle through you. Mm -hmm. And you can, like, feel your, like, muscle, like, contracting. Yeah. Wasn't your issue with like your shoulder girdle? I I don't know, dude. Or like chest? It's like stiff back and chest. Your uncle oh, so had to get a thing. needle in his head if that counts. What? what do you mean a needle in his head? <laughs> what does that mean? I don't even know what acupuncture is, dude. I don't know, my mom was into it. Your mom's probably into a lot of things. Uh, look, man. She hooked you don't know how to explain it? Like, it's just like needles or something, right? Like, I don't know. It's a new he had it done. Good old uh, needle in the head operation. Dude, I'm going to bring out the traditional Chinese medicine on you. Okay. 
Ready? I also I had cupping done, which is apparently another like pseudoscience thing, because I had these like cupping marks on my chest, and I was like walking around. I went to Dick's to get something, and the guy was asking me about it. He's like, "Oh yeah, you know it's like pseudoscience. Like, does it actually help you?" I'm like, I don't know, man. Did you feel better? I think. I don't know. Didn't it work? Concerning that you're going into the medical field, <laughs> are you? Who allowed this? Well, I don't know. Do you think placebo is a bad thing? Are you like actually close to going into the medical field? Because there's like a lot you have to do. Uh, movement, speed, water movement speed. Movement speed. Dude, I just so say that because most I people that like watch time. the stream are like ten, so I kind of just assume you like want to be a doctor. You're not like about to be a doctor, just starting actually. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you probably know more about it than me, like if you're about to go to school for it. My brother's girlfriend is a nurse and I'm pretty sure she like doesn't want to be a nurse anymore. 18, not 10. Okay, might be a record <laughs> for oldest viewer now. Hannah's also 18. She's my mod, she's still streaming right now. She started streaming recently. Mentally 10? I think I am too, to be honest. I'm literally like a child. Oh god. Joe, help, please. You took my spear. I didn't take your spear. You I I made... died and half my stuff's gone. I made, I made this spear with my own two hands. I'm definitely feeling the lower resource uh, gathering. I am I'm 20, probably mentally like 12. I turned 20 like two weeks ago, maybe. 20 in two weeks. Joe is a... Uh... Joe, when are you hitting double digits? You're nine, right? <laughs> Happy late birthday, thanks. When's your birthday? I'll, I'll remember it if you tell me. I'm really good at remembering birthdays. Like Joe's birthday is uh, June 7th. 2004. Let's go. <laughs> That's right, isn't it? November 10th, I'll remember that. No. I'm like really good. I like I like know all my friends' birthdays. I believe yours is April 10th. My, wait, dude, right? mine is. Dude, how'd you know? 2002. That that's right, bro. Did I get that right? You did. Six. My mm. So you gonna you gonna build that house in the same spot over there? I, I, I honestly just want to build in the redwoods. That, like we definitely can't do that yet. You can actually see the redwoods from here. If you look past that clearing. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Well. So, if you want to build again, then I'll I'll try and start taming stuff. Wait. Now that I don't have the tether holding me back. Yeah, we could definitely tame that guy at some point. Cross the, the pond. Dude, it scares me like how close I am to being done with college. Like I have three semesters left, and then like, all right, time to get a job. <laughs> uh, <laughs> only remember beaters of the people that are significant to you. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm pretty much like that. Maybe all my friends are significant to me. Perhaps. So heartwarming. <laughs> yeah. Joe, here's some... Sorry, here's some out, right? I'm, gonna, I'm gonna... Can you make a chest? Can that be like the first thing you make? Well, you have to place it on a platform. You don't want to start college? It seems terrible. I didn't really either. Um, My first like two weeks... I was like losing my mind like I don't know just being away from home is really stressful and my roommate was also like really weird he um he like pretended he was just like like he was just like a pathological liar he like pretended he was like he was from Miami but he pretended like he was this like gang member like ex gang member and like he got arrested twice and like <laughs> he was like he had this Naruto tattoo and he was like yeah dude like my gang made me get this when I left <laughs> It was it was just so crazy, but and he was five foot two, but he's probably like the most confident guy I've ever met. Just 
in like the lies he tells like i def i could tell he was lying i can show you a picture of us i could tell he was lying just because of how much i was around him but like people in our like suite like he would interact with they didn't they couldn't really tell and so like one day i don't know a few days a few days into it was like the first week probably this group of like i think junior or sophomore girls like <laughs> knocked on our door and he answered and they're like Mr. Miami. That's what that's what everyone called him. And they handed him a bottle of vodka. It's just the craziest thing I've ever seen. Like, because he would talk about like hanging out with like the, the junior girls or whatever. And I was like, oh, yeah, man, totally. But then like they just showed up to our door and bring him alcohol. Like it was so crazy, dude. I've, I've got like a ton of just <laughs> crazy stories about him, even though I was really only with him for two weeks. And that was a. Uh, 2020 so then after uh college college campus closed down because of covid so would have been so freaked out yeah i was yeah him being there definitely made me adjusting uh harder i i i well so we were there for two weeks and then campus closed so then we just went to online and then i didn't go back in the spring and then when i went back last fall i just did not room with him again i just did random again I'm trying to get um, an apartment next semester, like just a solo one, because I, I can't live with anyone because of my schedule. Like my other random roommate, he was like hyper normal, like maybe not even normal. He would like get in bed at like 8 p.m. and then I would go live at like 12. So I would be trying to stream and then he would be trying to sleep and it didn't really work. And I feel like most people I'm going to get tend to be like that. So unless I get like another computer science kid who's an alien. But me streaming would probably still just be annoying because I'm always allowed. You working on that chest, Joe? Um. <laughs> okay. Because you have to like put a bunch of ladders up. I just here. I just take my like. I'll just gonna. I'm just gonna drop stuff here because it's just like weighing me down. And like I don't need it. Um, why, dude? Why is the weight? You don't think you live on campus? You get homesick way too easily. I mean, you could give it a chance. Uh, does your college not have like a requirement where you have to live? Like I know a lot of colleges, at least here where I live, you need to live on campus for like one semester or like one year. I think it's just because they want to make money. But and then after that, you can like live like off campus. <laughs> met any of the weirdos i just described you would quit probably won't um i went to like a really big school or i go to a really big school so there's just like a lot of diversity and interesting characters i don't mean to group those two together but um not really a requirement because they're pretty close to your house oh, okay yeah my college is like two and a half hours away so i can't really commute there every day i'm home right now because I'm, I'm doing online don't get why he lied about being in a gang. It's just like, I don't know. It just like made him more interesting to people. Hey, I'm in a gang. <laughs> Are you? Gang of a tribe of humans. Yeah, dude. Wait. Nick, I noticed you're not contributing anything to the space. One of the, dude, one of the lies he did that like really pissed me off was like, like he knew I was a computer science major. And one time he had like two or three people uh, in our in our room and he, he goes onto his computer and he pulls up, you know, that website where it's like a fake hacking thing or it's just like the matrix code running down the screen. He pulls it up, he's like, dude, I'm hacking into every computer on campus right now, dude. And I literally was like, <laughs> bro, <laughs> no, you're not, man. It was so stupid. I'm pretty sure this guy was just was being kind of sarcastic. He wasn't, dude. Uh, Look, I'm in a gang. They made me get this Naruto tattoo. I'm so cool. Yeah, pretty much. Um, but from what I've heard, because he's in the same major as one of my friends, and it's like like ten or twenty people, so it's a pretty like close knit um group of people. So I've heard from them that he's kind of mellowed out, um, and he's kind of cool now. But I haven't really um. I mean, I saw him once last semester. He he goes to the gym a lot. He works out. He does a lot of like deadlifting and stuff. 
And so I went to the gym with him. Um, and to get into the gym, you have to like swipe your student ID card. And and keep keep in mind, he goes to the gym every day, or at least he says he does. I mean, he posts videos on his Instagram of him doing like deadlifts, like pretty much like every two days, in the in the the campus gym. And so I walk into the gym to like meet up with him, and the first thing I see is him like swiping his card like over and over again, like trying to figure out how to <laughs> which way to put it. It's just like insane to me because it's like you're in there every day. Like how can you mess that up? <laughs> I don't know. Taking a break from his ways, perhaps. I think he was just acting like that to like try and make friends or like to seem cool. And after he like, you know, made friends and got established, he sort of just mellowed out. I think because he knows he doesn't like need to act like that. It sounds like he only goes to record videos for his Instagram, but he deadlifts like a lot. Like he deadlifts like four hundred pounds. <laughs> So it's not, <laughs> it's not like, like an easy feat. I mean, I know Joe deadlifting is like easier if you're shorter, right? Or just most movements are because you're moving the weight less, less. Or a lot easier if you have like a longer sort of, uh, wait, no, shorter torso, longer arms. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, maybe I'm just wrong, but, but 400 is still like not easy. Yo, Hannah, yep. thanks for the raid. What's up? Welcome. It's called dedication. Yeah. He's just so committed to those instagram posts he can deadlift 400 pounds once and then then leave the gym i do i don't think i can deadlift 100 i'm gonna be honest yeah raid okay i'm gonna go kill stuff dude this is going so well right now this arc thatch house lol i'm gonna kill you whoever i don't know who you are i don't know where you came from i'm gonna kill you don't think you could deadlift at all. Yeah, I like workout though. I mean, I, I do like calisthenics, so I don't really mess around with weights, but this thatch house, we, we've accomplished this in like 20 minutes, okay? We are speed running the game right I, now. We, there's no way. And this is more progress than we've made in the past two days of playing. Okay, get it, get it like a, like a Bronx, Bronto. Yeah, let me just tame a Bronto real quick. We need a Bronto. Casual. There's no Wii. Hannah, are you going to play Ark? Hannah, we're, okay. If we could have like a dedicated berry gatherer, so we can make these strength arrows. <laughs> just dedicated berry gatherer, yeah. I mean, we do need we do need a lot of berries. You're invited. What? Still don't understand what this game is. Do you know what Rust is? Or like... Joe, what's another survival game like this? Uh, Monkey! Uh, no way. Oh, I'm dead. I screwed up. I'm dead. It's over. I'm gonna place a sleeping bag in a second. I think I'm fine. I'm like barely alive. Uh, I have a server now, so just uh, click on this link. You don't even need to have the game open. It should just open your game. You thought it was the forest. It's kind of like the forest. You're a great berry gather. Good. You just click that link and then it, or like put it in your browser and then it should just like open your game and then it joins the server. Put it, just like put it into your browser though, as if it was. This is the only way I've figured out how to join. His IP doesn't work and it doesn't show up in the server list, so I had to do this weird thing. I mean, the forest is kind of similar. I think the crafting in the forest is different. Um, I mean, Joe played a lot of the forest, but never really uh, beat it. It's more of like a, it's not. And I say Rust because Rust is like the most similar survival game to this that I can think of. Um, I wanted to skip the cloth stuff, but I, I haven't. The, the XP is so much lower now, I don't have the other stuff. Somehow I had your stream open on 10 different tabs. What? <laughs> I mean, sorry, two different browsers. 
That's a big difference. Yeah. I don't like this guy. Oh, no. Okay. Apparently, that's the, the cue for him to just murder me. <laughs> Thought Rust was a horror game? Nah, Rust is a survival game. The Forest is a horror game. Survival horror game. Is it not? I'm pretty sure it's not. It is just like strictly survival. As you can tell, I'm not a gamer. It's okay. Panda's not a gamer either. I really wish you didn't make me turn off the death bag location. <laughs> yeah, but aren't your items just that more valuable? Yeah, I want to get this monkey. I don't remember how to tame it though. Yeah, this guy is a bit of an issue. Um, I don't know why he's here in the easy area. Facebook message from Deuce Bigelows. <laughs> That's a weird name. I think you just have to like give it berries or something. I don't remember. I don't know what the exact food item is. I can look it up. Okay, he's crossed back over. I mean, that guy's really our, our only threat right now. Welcome back, Wolfie. I mean, as long as he stays like on the other side, we should be fine. And it doesn't seem like he attacks unless you get like right right up right up on him, so if we could... <clears throat> Yeah, we definitely need to beat the forest before the forest two comes out. Do you really want to? I do. Okay, I'm gonna try and tame a pterodon. Yeah, we need like a big dino pen area. That'd be sick. Hannah, did the uh, did the link thing work for you? I, you might not be able to respond if your game's loading. Wait, when my, did we get Mango my computer just over? completely freezes when Ark's loading, so I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and where did all the pterodons go? It took a while to load. Are you you in though? I don't really have a way of knowing. Spawn South Zone One. South zone one. Oh, the Baryonyx is a... Yeah, south zone one. Yeah, is it coming back? Hey, wait, can you can you uh like pull it away from me? Uh it's gonna immediately kill me. It, it's you don't built, just like don't I built this house. Don't go right next to it and you'll be fine. Like it didn't attack me until I literally was in like two feet of it. Oh. Yeah. I keep thinking I can't go far away, but I can. I wish I could do higher settings because this game like actually looks pretty good. Um, not on <laughs> all lowest settings. Okay, I found a pterodon. It's landing. I'm gonna go for it. Making character. Please don't make your character horrifying again. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just you wait. Oh god. Joe's made quite the creation this time. I don't know if you if you why what oh my god yeah, I'm getting bullied. Hard to turn my settings up. Hold on. I just need to put food in and then run away All right now we leave Dude, movement speed's 100% the best upgrade. It's so crazy. <clears throat> yeah, because eventually all your weight's just gonna be like offloaded to some dinosaur. Yeah, dude. The more horrifying, the better it adds to the character. You know, I do, I do enjoy looking at Joe's character. What do you mean enjoy? <laughs> I don't know. You can. Uh... Oh, okay. What do you think I meant? Dude, I've got my stats. We'll say stuff like that, but you won't install naturalism, V2. 
Joe, I'm not going to install a nudity mod when I'm streaming. I can't do that. Why not? If you spawn South Zone 1, you should be, like, really close. Like, you should be over where I'm looking. Like, over across I'll, I'll the river. Down. I might be looking at you. I can't tell. Like, you should spawn over there. And then you just, like, come over here. Did I get my $12 worth? $12 worth from what? You mean from Ark? How do you know I paid twelve dollars for this game? How do you know that? How do you know I paid twelve dollars for the humble monthly that this game was in? And then, how do you know that? I guess. I mean, I said humble monthly. I didn't think you'd like extrapolate the price. Jeez, dude. Doing some like detective work. How was the taming? I said it yesterday. I didn't. Did I say the price? Why is this thing not eating? Wait, you didn't turn crosshairs on for bows. That's a setting. Probably. Uh, it looks like it. <laughs> Dude, how is that a setting? Because it is. I think I'm stuck. <laughs> Yo, could you come help me? I can't. Because you turned name plates off. I'm not oh, the way never mind. It got up to eat. I'm safe. Oh, uh, I paid 13 for the server. I paid 12 for the game. And honestly, at first, you know, the server wasn't working great. I wasn't. I wasn't really happy with the purchase, but it's working now, so I am pretty happy with the with the 13 dollars. 12.99. Sorry, I'm rounding it to 13. kind of taking a while mm. Wait, where are you? um if, if you like kind of come back uh, away from the rock wall and then go up that is where i am i'm taming a pterodon it's knocked out right now yeah i have my stats final tomorrow and haven't watched any of the lectures this whole semester so i'm not really looking forward to it guy's so fast oh my god joe when are you done with the uh, school stuff uh like a month i think a month yeah i'm ending like pretty early at least compared to my friends what i've heard You still gonna do the the lifeguarding job over the summer? Um, no. Do you? What are you gonna do? Uh, um, I have applied for Ingles store clerk. Ingles. With Walmart. You really gonna do the overnight shift at Walmart? I'm really considering it. it just sounds fun i mean you can you can try i've never done an overnight shift so i don't really know mm -hmm. i don't know i just didn't like getting out at 6 a.m oh is that you hannah oh my god <laughs> the chad face is so off off-putting Join, join the tribe. Also, don't don't get too close to it because if you walk onto it, you might get stuck. I think we need to put the taming speed up because uh, it's eating like really slowly. Like, it should not be this hard to 
to tame this pterodon. Did I ever tell you about my first arc experience, Joe? On a public uh, server? Uh, um, you probably got like raided during the night. No. What? What else could happen? If I do the tribe again, okay. You got um, by uh, ten South Koreans. No, I immediately ran into someone. Mm -hmm. It was this like twenty-five-year-old Canadian girl, and she locked me in a box. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and then my character's name okay. is Richard, which is why I still use the name Richard now for my character. And like yeah. my, it was on my old nine seventy, so my game was just like lag. I was getting like twenty FPS, and she was just like, "Richard, I know you're in there, Richard," and I couldn't come out because she closed the door, and I wasn't <laughs> in her tribe. <laughs> I was like stuck in there for thirty minutes. <laughs> I think I still have her on Steam. <laughs> That's awesome. It was really cool. Playing Ark in like 8th grade, dude, when I first got my computer. Pretty good. I think the bad. <laughs> what? Camping in front of the house. The Baryonyx is just spawn camping in front of our house. Okay, I don't think we're equipped enough to kill it yet. Um, oh my god, is the thing eating the pterodon? Oh no, okay. Dude, they're so slow. <laughs> Look at them crawl over here. Oh. I hit the Baryonyx. Oh no. Yeah, I, I'm sorry. I like can't help you. Like, <laughs> there's no way to I kill that the thing. <laughs> I, like, I don't know. Yeah, we definitely didn't do the settings right because it's everything's so slow, dude. Yeah. Like, it's yeah. gonna take like 30 minutes to tame this. Okay, I've gotta go to bed. You do. It's only 12.40, dude. 9 a.m. I probably should, because I have, uh, I got my stats final, and I need to, like, learn uh, the entire uh, course uh, before my final. Every time, yeah, Joe's got that early bedtime now. You really hate to see it. Wait, Joe... Man, they just run away. If you go far enough, they'll stop. They already stopped chasing you. Look, they're going the other way. They're like insanely slow. You don't have to worry about them chasing. Yeah, I don't. Cause I, okay. I feel like it's not even worth like playing on these settings because it's like so slow. Okay, try to tame an Anklio. Saurus. An Anklio? If you can. An ink? Leo? An ink. Yeah. Look, because remember they get a bunch of rocks? Oh, yeah, rocks. well, they they get a bunch of metal. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, but if we could have them, what? and then when we get the um, Argentavis. Okay. And then we could tame Megalodons, and then we could build the underwater base. Okay, 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 okay. Write this all out in like a sheet of paper. I'm going to forget all of this. Just build an underwater base, but we need metal for it. Okay. Or I think we need, like, tech. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to mess with the settings a bit. Um. But. Okay. Good we will luck. get it figured out. We will get it figured out. Yeah. Your arms are so long. Oh, my God. Yeah, Dude. <laughs> Yeah, I don't really want to go over by the house because the Baryonyx is over there. Stay away from that guy. He's really, he's really scary. Yeah, I'm on. I honestly might just end and then 
figure out the settings for like tomorrow and also study for stats so I don't get a 40 on the on the final. Uh, it's kind of important. Uh, yep. 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 Because, like, on the settings we usually play on, it's, like, like, 30 seconds to tame a Pterodon. It's just, like, the, we change them because the default settings are so, like, just unbearably boring to play on. Because everything is so slow and takes so long. And then when you die and lose everything, like, you just have to do it all over again. It's really painful. But even when things are going well, like right now, like it's still just uh pretty painful. <laughs> Alright, good luck. Yeah, thanks for, for hanging out. Well beside it was good talking to you. I feel like we haven't I haven't spoken to you that much. Um But yeah. I'm gonna, I'll find someone to raid real quick and then study for stats. Uh which is anyone mm, no of course no problem yeah 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 hope to to see you in here in the future um bacon on a tank who's like an actual person 18 plus what the heck Mod and bikini. I try to come and chat as much as you're able to. Right, I I appreciate it. Looking looking forward to it. New server watches dominate. Uh, all the people with, with cameras are like Spanish, dude. Yeah, thanks for watching, Wolfie. Uh, as usual, we'll see ya, dude. Why are there so many Spanish streamers playing Ark? I just want to rate in English. I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want to have to deal with the language barrier. Here we go. Day twenty six. Happy Thursday. Um, maybe. I don't know. I don't even know. I've also got a project I'm gonna have to do, so I'm gonna probably be working until like right before midnight. So the start of the stream is gonna be really hectic. But yeah, I'll, I don't know. I'll see. I'll see. I'll see. I'll see. Yes. Uh, you. Yep. You. Yep. That's right. I'm racist. Wait, where's the... I wish... Oh, dude, I have to go to the stupid Twitch dashboard every time to get to the freaking raid thing. Okay. Thanks for watching. I'll be live again tomorrow. Where's the raid thing? There we go. All right. Yeah, I know you guys really enjoy ARK, so uh, make sure you get you watch this guy's stream. You know, he's good at ARK, and you really like watching ARK, and 